Unraveling the Mystery of Haunted Dreams. Hello everyone, welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore a fascinating phrase, haunted dreams. It's a term that can evoke powerful images and emotions. So, grab a cup of coffee, and let's dive into the world of language and imagination. First, let's break down the phrase. The word, haunted, generally refers to something being visited or inhabited by a ghost or spirit. But it's not just about ghosts in old houses. In a broader sense, haunted can describe anything that is persistently occupied or troubled by something, especially memories or thoughts. Now, on to dreams. Dreams are sequences of images, ideas, emotions, and sensations that occur involuntarily in the mind during certain stages of sleep. However, in a figurative sense, dreams can also refer to aspirations or long-held wishes. When we combine these words to form haunted dreams, we get a phrase rich in meaning. It suggests dreams that are repeatedly disturbed or influenced by troubling thoughts, memories, or fears. These could be literal dreams during sleep or metaphorical ones, like unfulfilled desires or ambitions constantly overshadowed by past experiences or anxieties. Haunted dreams isn't just a poetic or literary phrase. It has practical uses in everyday English. For example, someone might say, ever since the accident, I've had haunted dreams, to express that they are troubled by recurring nightmares about a past traumatic event. I hope this video helps you understand the depth and beauty of the phrase, haunted dreams. Remember, language is not just about words, it's about the stories and emotions they convey. Until next time, Keep exploring and enjoying the journey of learning English.